after so many years because I'm not really into the makeup. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today, I'm reviewing <laughs> Ipsy. Unboxing Ipsy. I finally decided to subscribe to them. And yeah, I finally received it today. Actually, I was supposed to get it tomorrow, but I had a notification saying it got to my local post office. And I was like, okay, I've been waiting for this too much. So I just told my husband to go pick it up or else I would be doing this video tomorrow. Y como que no. And I have been waiting for this. I think I ordered it like maybe like the last week of November and I finally got it today. I don't know, for me, it kind of took forever to get here. Maybe, I don't know if I'm spoiled. Every time I like shop anywhere, it just gets here like less than a week. So yeah, I was anxious to open this. And I'm gonna go ahead and open this right now. Um, a ver. Vamos a ver qué pedo con esto. Um, So the first thing I have here is we designed this brush to make your life easier. I hope so. And let's see how it looks. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay, so I got this. What is it for though? Um, it's a bronzer, which I'm excited for because I haven't. I lost mine in Mexico. I know. And here it is. It almost had a get into this to brush. Mm. Plus, it's vegan and cruelty free. Hmm. I'm all about that. And the value of this brush is $35. I wonder how many things they sent me. Because the box did say something about. Oops. <laughs> um, the... Okay. It's Monday. So my package check just says attention customer received unsealed. Hmm. Fishy. So I got this Itsy the Van Ness eyebrow. Itsy the Van Ness eyeshadow quad, which is, I think, yeah, it's this one. The ultimate winter eyeshadow quad. Hmm. I actually, I think it has some like purple shades in there. I've never really done a purple eye look, which I really never do my makeup. But either way, I've never got eye. Purple eyeshadow. It comes like this. Interesting. Mm. Okay, let's swap these eyeshadows and see how it gets con esto. I guess you can see a little bit. Pretty. Let's see the next one. Like matte colors. I know, sorry guys, it's a really bad swap, but... So... So I swapped them and then I Como le hago? Okay. Mm -hmm. Cute. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I'm excited to use this. Ooh, I like the mirror too. I don't think I've had this... This is a big mirror before. So, oh, and I forgot to mention the eyeshadow palette, which I hopefully it comes with more eyeshadows. I don't know. Anyways, the value is $60. So yeah, sorry guys, I'm new to this. I also got an eyeliner, a black eyeliner. It, I think, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but it's Il Yama. Il Yama Kala. Ila, Ila Makaska liquid, I think. You don't have to worry about running or smearing during the day. Mm. We'll see about that tomorrow. And the value is $22. How do you do this? 
Así. No manches, no sé. Should I do a little swap for the eyeliner? A ver, vamos a ver. Anyways. My next item is this Morphe lipstick. Uh, let's see. What's the color of it? It's the Morphe Mega Lip Matte Lipstick in Morphe. Oh, okay. So the color is called Morphe. Is it backwards? I don't know. Well, anyways, it's Morphe. It's the brand Morphe and the color Morphe. Mm, just walk. Why do I do this? There. It doesn't look that red. Pero vamos a ver mañana. Okay, and then I also got these four facial masks. It's from Feel Beauty Brilliant Bamboo Charcoal Facial Sheet Mask Set of 4 And the value is 35 Set of 4 And then this is to detox the dirt away This is all I received And then I also got, of course, a little baggie Which is okay Not my style, but you know And then I am also thinking of doing my makeup tomorrow and showing you guys the products I got today to see how I feel about them and towards the end of the day when I'm ready to take out my makeup um give you guys a review of how I felt about the makeup and then I'll just try one of these as well and yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow morning guys I'm back and I'm gonna start by doing my makeup it's already morning and yeah, I'm gonna see. A ver, cómo me sale el eyeliner. Okay, cause I thought about it, and I don't think that red lipstick goes with the purple. I don't know. I just don't think. I don't think it goes together. Pero son Hmm. I don't know. What do you guys think? Purple and red go together? I don't think so. I think so. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna do red lipstick and then the eyeshadow, I don't know, I'll try it on some other day. But I'll, I'll do the red lipstick and black eyeliner. To start off, I'm just gonna pamper my skin with this NYX Studio Primer Base. Last time I put a lot on my face, it was like white. <laughs> I mean, is this normal? I don't know. When I do put primer, it's not white. It's just clear. And I just ran out of it. So I had to go to one more bright one. I'm using this It Cosmetics. Pero como que now that it's cold, um, my skin kind of gets drier. I don't know, it gets flaky towards the end of the day. So I don't like that. Ahead and investigate what foundation would go with my skin right now that's winter. And I found this Neutrogena. Oops, sorry, it's kind of dirty. This one. And I, um, yeah. I think it's, I think it's, it's going well. My skin isn't as dry. Do my eyebrows first before I apply foundation. What do you guys do first? Your eyebrows or your makeup and then eyebrows? It just seemed right to do my eyebrows first. I'm just gonna do it natural because it's not the trabajo. I don't know. Can you guys see the difference? And I like the little brocha. I think it's pretty cool. Um, the it cosmetic is like a little pumper. Yeah, I like this one better because I could just like literally not waste it and just apply it in my skin right away. I'm just gonna blend it. My nose is really dry. I don't know. I had asked the lady at I think it was Sephora that I needed a brush for foundation to blend it, and this is what she suggested. 
So don't judge me if it's not the right one. <laughs> I don't know, there's always one that I like best and it's this one I think Wet and Wild blush a little bit could go a long way guys See, I must, okay <laughs> My stress, little pop house oh, I told you guys Se nota luego luego For the loose powder. I'm gonna have to use that new brush I got for the contour. I'm just gonna use it because I put too much. I know guys, I have big eyes. I know. Um, I've heard that for like, no more than like, how old am I? Okay, I'm not gonna count my first years, so 22 years. Because at the age of three, I can't remember if I still did but let's just say at the age of three or four dry eye you hold this i can hold i wait <laughs> um yeah in like in la secundaria in mexico oh heck no ahí me la quemaban mm, whatever i don't care i love my big eyes you're so mean. Why? I'm really basic when it comes to makeup, especially for work. So I'm just gonna apply this. Okay, I don't mind the color, just that I wouldn't be. Eh, I shouldn't be talking about applying this, huh? Okay. Okay, guys, so this is what I came up with because I didn't want to put the purple eyeshadow. So, yeah, and I just did a simple bun. I'll let you guys know towards the end of the day how this ended up with my eyeliner and lipstick. <laughs> so, I just got back from work and ready to review how I went all day today. Um, the eyeliner seems to be still there, just a little faded. And then the lipstick, I don't know, I added some of the ones I have in my bag. I had ate a snack. It looked kind of faded, like it was out of red, but oh, it's this one. So yeah, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and say what I thought about the eyeliner and the lipstick. The lipstick, I don't think it says the 24 hours. So I'll give that a break. But I just won't buy Morphe lipsticks. I would rate the lipstick 1 out of 10. I would rate it mm, a 6. The eyeliner, so I wouldn't recommend it for like a party or like an all day event. I would rather recommend this liner instead of this one. I would rate it a 7.5. Hey guys! I'm back. So this morning I decided to do the, to mess with the eyeshadow I got from my Ipsy bag. And I can't believe it let me go out like this, especially matte. I mean, I look bruised up like someone punched me. I don't know. What do you guys think? Um, I think I could have done a better job, but I don't really mess with makeup. But all, like, come on, people, tell me something. <sighs> I would give it an eight, like not this look, but just the palette. And yeah, um, not really digging this. I don't know if you could tell what I see. I took some pictures in the morning, so I'll probably drop some out. 
I don't know, I was cringing at work. I'm like, I can't wait to get home and take it off. I look bruised up, guys. I don't know, what do you guys think? I, I don't know, maybe if I would've put some eyeshadow or some falsies, it would've come out better, but didn't have time this morning. I'm gonna end the video right now. Thank you for the ones that made it this far. <laughs> and I'll probably just still keep Ipsy for two more months and see if I like it. This package was I, I would just rate it like a mm, eight. I would rate it eight. I haven't tried the mask. I know I told you guys I would show you guys the mask, but uh, I just want to end it. I don't care for it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this Ipsy review. If so, give it a thumbs up. And I hope to see you guys next week.